Welcome to Computer Tech TV. My name is Rick Arter, and today I'll be doing an unboxing and product overview on the Palette GTX 460 Overclocked Sonic Edition video card. Starting with the outside of the box, you're going to notice that Palette has uh, done very nice graphics and everything on the outside here. You can see all the information. You got DirectX 11, 3D Vision, Physics. CUDA and SLI support. This card supports single SLI. It has one bridge so it can do two cards and two-way SLI. Then this is the Sonic Overclocked Edition version of this card. Down here you can see it's a 1 gigabyte model, 1024 megabytes of GDDR5 memory. And the connectors on the back of the card they also list here is the dual DVI, they have a VGA, and an HDMI connector. Okay, on the back of the card you're going to notice it says what the card is, GeForce GTX 460 3D graphics engine by Palette. They also have uh, their specifications, technical specifications in English as well as 11 other languages. And they also, over here on the right side, they have some pictures of uh, just different gameplay and suggestions on what you can do and what this card's capable of. And being this is an NVIDIA product, it is very good at folding at home, so if you're looking for a really good uh, video card for folding at home on a budget, I really suggest getting a GTX 460. Uh, the pallet version is very nice. And here's the front, and the sides basically just give you some more information. As you can see there. And the other sides are pretty much exactly the same, just specifications of the product then you have your palette 3D graphics engine shown proudly so now let's uh, break the security seals here and uh, open this up and show you guys what's inside okay now upon uh, purchasing the card when you go to open it up you're going to see they have one security seal here and another security seal here. If these are broken, uh, go ahead and open it up, make sure everything's there, go ahead and test the card. If it works, then I wouldn't worry about it. If the card does not work, however, I would definitely be calling the place that you bought it for if it's within their warranty time or call Pallet to uh, discuss some uh, RMA issues. And now let's uh, open this up and show you guys what's inside. Okay, I've removed the outside box and uh, there's another cardboard box inside all the contents. Let's open that up. On opening the box, this is what it looks like. Now let's open this up and uh, see what's inside. And it just opens up real simple like that. And one thing else to note, this is a non-reference PCB and a non-reference cooler for anybody who's interested to know. Included is a uh, six pin to dual Molex power adapter. video card aside. Have your driver's disk, but as always you want to go to the NVIDIA site and download the latest drivers. And you have a NVIDIA quick installation guide. I've removed the video card from the anti-static bubble wrap packaging. And as you can see, this is what it looks like when it comes out of the box. A very nice fan there. Keep the card nice and cool. There's all your back connectors that I mentioned earlier. PCI Express 2.0. It has two six pin power connectors here on the other side. Instead of having them on the back, it takes up less room. You can see you get some airflow that'll come out there. And this uh it does have some vents on the back, but most of the air is actually going to be exhausted into your case. But if you have good case cooling, you should be perfectly fine. They also provide some small little pieces of clear plastic to protect this part of the heat sink here during shipping. So that about wraps it up, guys. Just a little quick view of this card here. I know you're probably wanting to see more and specs and everything, but that will be coming in a future video review and do a temperature test on this card. I'll run it through some benchmarks and show you guys what it can do if anybody's uh, interested in that, please subscribe. 
and uh, thanks a lot for watching guys you guys have a great day